You ready? All right, so here we go with round one. Seems to be a situation in which he wants to do everything in his power to keep this fight on the feet. He'd appear to have a lot of advantages at distance. We'll see if he can get it done tonight. Yes, he has all the advantages because we don't see many specialists anymore in the UFC. Guys can generally do everything, but this guy is a jiu-jitsu player. He wants to get the fight to the ground and start to weave his weapon. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Man, this is some serious ground and pound. He's trying to put this dude's head like through the canvas. He's one of the better ground and pound fighters. We have oh, now trying to isolate an arm, DC. He needs to move his hips back to cover. He cannot allow him on that angle. You gotta be careful, arm bar. has been isolated, but he picks him up and slams him down. He lifted him through the air, slammed him on his back, and moved right into side control to get out of danger. Beautiful job to not just turn defense into offense, but also to end up in a dominant position. All right, he's got side control here, DC. You know, he's got a lot of different submissions in his arsenal once this fight gets to the ground. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Staying busy in the clinch to avoid a separation. Big kick. Oh, huge block. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Blocks that strike. It's such a fast leg Another kick. Another nice leg kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, combination lands. You want to talk about putting strikes together. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. Oh, he got him. He got him. Fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. All right, so you got to be careful. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. So the fighter was really caught in a submission there just as the horn sounded. Okay, ready? Round two. You ready? Let's go, fight. And potentially a critical takedown here. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now the grounded power Working star. on a guillotine. now. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Ooh, what a head kick. Oh, nice job there defensively to block that knee attempt. Good work by Oliveira. Wow, what a head kick. Beautiful oh. knee. Oh. 
So 33 total strikes have landed for Charles Oliveira. And striking at a foul. Oh, a huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Oh, big knee! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. Oh. So have we, your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. So there he is after the big TK. Bruce Buffer has the official decision.